Hey everybody, it's Blue Toad, and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies. We're in the pool at night now, and there's fog. So, uh, yeah, we're gonna have an interesting time with this. Also, the no pee, in, no, no pee shooters in the pool is only for during the daytime, I believe, possibly, based on reading the achievement information. Uh, but let's, uh, go ahead and set up some mushrooms. Which I think there's also an achievement for not using mushrooms in something. But I don't, I don't know what, what that is specifically. Um, I guess I don't need that. I'm going to do that instead. We have to get rid of the fog. And we have to get rid of everything else that we can. Uh, there's a lot of problems with this. It's fine. There's a dolphin zombie. There's a balloon zombie. Uh, we might be able to get by with just the blower, maybe. Because this is our new... Or blower. This is our new, um, new plant that we get for at night, I guess. I think we can use it anytime, but anyway. Let's try this and see how it goes. And hopefully it'll be alright. It should be. But anything can happen, so. It's level 4-4 four, four as well, which means the next level's gonna be... A special level. Here they come. We haven't had any of the zombies reach the other side of the level yet. Because none of the- we haven't actually used any of the lawnmowers before. So it'll be interesting to see how that will work out. If that will ever work out. Hopefully it won't happen. But, I mean, it could happen at any point, so... There's a zombie up there. We can kind of see it behind the fog because of it being at the top of the screen, luckily. That's the only blind spot that the zombies have in their attack. Because we can actually see them. It's not really a blind spot, but that that's the word I'm going with. It's fine. Anyway. We've almost got our sun shrooms in place. Almost, but not quite. And I really want to use the blover to reveal what else there is to deal with. Okay, the sun is coming through now, which is good. There's just a few other things that I want to deal with. Uh-oh, that's a cone zombie. I need to do something about that, if I can, please. Let's do that there. Okay, do we, we managed to defend for a little bit, but we're going to need better than that. Next time there's a zombie of that type. Let's blow that away. Speaking of that type of zombie, let's do something about it, because there's another one right there. We need more sun right now. A lot more sun. Let's get rid of you, hopefully. In theory. But yes, we can blow away the fog and any... Balloon zombies with the blover, which will be good, but hopefully we won't, won't run any, into any troubles with that. I think they can't be affected by um, the lawnmowers if they the balloon zombies fly over the top of them, possibly, which would not be good. So I'm gonna try and deal with that. I didn't realize that that was a cone zombie down there that I need to deal with. Boy, I think I've got it under control now, hopefully. Do that. Here comes the fog. We need more sun, please. Just to make sure that I'm not gonna, gonna be in trouble with balloon zombies. Okay. Oh boy. Stuff in the water now. That's gonna make things even more fun. Okay. We're gonna keep planting. First wave of zombies, but there are two waves, so we're gonna be good for a little bit. Just a little bit, not a lot. Get rid of that, please. And please don't spawn in the balloon zombies after I use the blover, because I'd be just sad in general. Okay. 
Our defense is looking a lot better now. My only concern is the fog. And not having a sun for blovers. But uh, that might just be... Alright, possibly. I usually don't use the blovers, so... I usually just set up the cactuses. The cacti. I don't know. Oh, there's a blover. No, there's a the balloon zombie. Please. Please, sun. Sun, 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 sun. Okay. That should work over there, right? Yeah. Cool. Good, 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 good. Let's do this here. It's nice having the fume shrooms just hit all the, zo the zombies in a row. Let's do this over here as well. Oh, I see you. I see you. Oh, let's get a review. Okay. There's another one. Sun, 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 sun. Good. Okay, we have things under control mostly, except there's another one. Okay, come on, sun, 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 sun! Sun! Give me the sun! More sun! There we go. Let's get rid of you, and there's all that to get rid of as well. Oh, and there's the dolphin zombie. Okay, maybe I'll slow down for a second. We're at the final wave, so we should be good. <laughs> but, oh my goodness. This has been an interesting... This has been an interesting introduction to everything happening in this world. It's kind of an introduction, not really, but anyway. Let's blow you all away. And I think we should be good. Just have to make sure it's symmetrical. Get rid of him, get rid of him, get rid of him. Perfect. Hey, a taco! That's what I'd expect to get in this game, as a random item. Taco! What are you gonna do with a taco? You found my magic taco! I must have it, I'll give you a thousand dollars for it. Yes, the taco is mine! Why'd I give you so much for money for a taco? Because I'm crazy! You take a look around my shop and no you'll notice I have some new items in stock. So, we now have some new stuff. I believe this plant, this cattail, uh, you can place it on water and it works similarly to a cactus. So, uh, and this fume shroom thing, uh, I believe is an upgrade to the fume shroom which will just shoot in every direction. So, that's also good, and I believe this uh, is a is an upgrade to the repeater, but it's it's only if you have it in your seed packet. Like, but you have to have both seed packets and then pay for both to upgrade them. So, but that's that's that what that one is. Uh, we can also get another rake thing to just in case I need it. Uh, but we can buy an eighth slot. So let's do that. Oh my goodness, ninth slot is twenty thousand. Well, we're definitely gonna want that, but it's gonna be a little bit before we get that. So. Act now, cause I'm crazy! Okay. Me and my buddy Harvey, Flax- Flaxcaster, used to be- used to break va- uh, Vases when we were bored. Well, Harvey's out of town, so you're coming with me, Harvey number two. Break it like you mean it, Harvey! My name's not Harvey. Okay, so now we have to just break the pots here to find out what's inside. And then we can possibly get either a plant or a zombie come out. Like that. But we want to be strategic about this so we can actually not lose, basically. Got the rake there to save us. But there are two, like, there are several rows of these. So hopefully once we take out the zombie we can find out what else is in here. Another zombie. It's unlucky. We could just break all of them and hope for the best. But it's probably better to just... Do it carefully. Come on, take out the zombie, please. There we go. Let's find out what's in the last one. It's a squash. Okay, so let's put that there. And let's break that. Another squash. So many squashes right now. This is actually really good to have this many squashes. Another squash. We can open that up to find out what it is. It's a buckethead zombie, but that'll be taken care of. Another squash. Put that over there. That row is completely cleared now, so... Uh, let's do over here. Okay, interesting. 
think we are good. I think we're good. You know, I think we're good. I think we're great, actually. That was not very difficult at all. It gave us a lot of stuff that we didn't really need when we needed it. When we got it. I don't know. But there we go. Man, you broke those vases nice and good. Break them like the time I broke my back digging through those trash cans. Here, I brought you some more vases. Vases. Gotta be careful about breaking them too fast, though. You don't want to end up with more zombies than you can handle, haha. Uh -huh. So now we have these two leaf vases, vases, whatever. Uh, and they were- they're guaranteed to have a plant inside of them, so let's do that. Okay, interesting. Just need to be careful not to run into anything too difficult. Interesting. Interesting. Let's do that one. Okay, that's fine. Now let's break one of those and those. Try and get rid of you, try and put that there. Let's break that one. Okay, the rake was completely pointless. But that's okay. Gonna put that there just in case, but we don't need it. Break that open, that'll be taken care of by the squash. Final one, and we're good. We just need to wait now, unfortunately. I'm not even sure if we'll be able to... If we need the squash over here, I'm pretty sure we can... Pro nah, it's not gonna be taken out fast enough. Probably. Come on, I believe. <laughs> it probably doesn't matter anyway because the squash is gonna get it when it gets to the pea shooter, so. And there it goes. Gone. Alright, this should be the last of them. Break these and you'll be all done. Cool, let's find out what we have. We have a pea shooter, a pea shooter, and a pea shooter. Probably wasn't efficient the way I did that, but that's okay. Uh, let's put that there and try to use the rake in a useful way. Also, that guy will convert everything. Oh no, that's not good. Oh, that's not good at all. Let's slow you down, please. Thank you. I'm in trouble. It's fine. Let me fix this quickly. Okay. Oh my goodness. Everything all at once. More snow peas. That's good to know. Ah, uh, cool. Let me do that. That. And I think we're good. <laughs> Probably. Just need to wait now. I made a mess of that, but I somehow brought it back. But there we go. Split P shoots peas forward and backwards, but it shoots one forward and two backwards. Which will be useful for some things, like this new zombie over here. If I can find it, the digger zombie. The digger zombies are interesting because they don't go towards your house, kind of. Because they, they the way that they do it is they dig underground until they get to your house and then go the other direction, taking you from behind. And we don't have any way to deal with that except for the split pea, so we're going to want the split pea. Ah, uh, so let's figure out how I'm going to do this. going to need the split pea, for sure. Uh, this is as bad as far, about as far as I th have thought about this. It's 125, but that's okay. I think I'm going to go the plantains. And maybe... Torchwood. Maybe. And spikeweed. I don't think there's any balloon zombies, so we should be good. Let's go. And also no swimming zombie things. Not not very many variations of them, at least. But let's see how this goes. This could be either really good or really messy. Probably the messy one. Knowing me. But I'm sure it'll be fine. Probably. I just need to believe. They're on their way. Get more sun going, please. Put a the second row. It's over there, okay. More sun. 
There we go. It feels like you don't have much control at the very beginning, but it starts out very, very peaceful compared to later on. In the level, so. It can't throw everything at you immediately because you have to actually plant your garden first. Come on, sun. Thank you. Just trying to keep on top of sun shrooms currently. Although I'm probably going to run into trouble with cone zombies. I assume. Okay. That's all the sun shrooms out. Let's put in a, lant a plantern. And let's hopefully survive. Need to get more sun so we can actually put in the, the main defense. Let's go with that. I'd also like to put in the other plantain, please. Where well, it's taking a while to recharge, so... Let's do that one there. Oh, a gift! Puzzle mode unlocked. Play it from the main menu. Well, we're gonna take a minute before we get to that, so... Oh, digger zombie, I need sun. I need sun, I need sun, I need sun, I need sun. They also get confused for a little bit when they get out of the ground. Oh, son, please. Please take him out. He's, t he's, he's eating my sun shrooms. This is not kind. Put another sun shroom there. Please take it out. They're also very slow, at least. But I was not ready for him when he came for me. Okay, now we're prepared for them. Of course he chose the one that I didn't have the split peas on. Also, we're going to want to have more split peas in. Just as regular defense, but we also have the the, sh the puff shrooms doing their job, so that's going to help with everything. Okay, final wave. That was fast. It's probably a good thing though. Zombies come from out out from the deep. There's a miner there, but he's not going to make it. Just because I have the split pee on him. No, nope. click the right one. Oh, he actually, he actually took out the sun shroom. So we really need more than that. What I put in there to take them out, so. Um, 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 um. I should have put that forward because I can they do more from the back. You know? It's fine. Anyway. Do that because it will do more damage. Anyway. This is gonna be a lot better though. This 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 new plant is gonna be super helpful. Starfruit. Shoot stars in five directions. Which isn't exactly crazy. But it's it's useful when they when you have multiple of them. They shoot in the directions of Back, up, down, and then diagonally, uh, forward, basically. But not actually straight forward, I don't think. Possibly. I think it's, I th I'm pretty sure, if I'm, unless I'm mistaken, it's in the, the directions that it's, the points are pointing, so. Actually, maybe it does go sight, I don't know. I'm making it up as I go along, it's fine. Uh, let's do all the things that we need. Gonna want the plantain. Gonna want the star fruit as our main everything at this point. Uh, I guess we'll grab a few extra things. Uh, let's grab a split pea and a spike weed. I don't really know what to grab, so I'm just grabbing things. I'm a little bit concerned about the jack-in-the-box zombie. It'll be fine, probably. Ready, set, plant. Perfect. That's what you want to see. Not quite what I was going for, but that will work. Also, there seems to be more fog. Am I crazy or is there just more fog? I think there's just more fog. Rain. 
I don't think that this happened. I don't remember this. It's fine. I need more sun, please. Hey, where's that one? I can't see it. There it is. There just is more fog. I didn't realize that this happened. I don't like how much fog there is right now. I also don't like that the the overlay for the the seed is underneath the fog. And I don't know why you would do that. Unless it's just set in in, in the the way it writes everything on or draws everything onto the screen. Is just do it in like the default order and then everything after that. Ah, uh, let's do that so I can see a little bit. Sun shroom. Oh, cone zombie. Oh, cone zombie. How, 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 how you do? Need to get rid of you. Please, everything. Throw everything at it, please. I don't have enough sun to deal with this right now. Just keep putting in the bad shrooms. The puff sh Just drag your puff shrooms until it works. Okay, let's see what we're looking at now. Interesting. Very interesting. Ah, uh, that's the last sun shroom. Now we just need enough sun to st start planting the stars. Come on. Star. Go for it. This should work, probably. <laughs> I might be a little bit hopeful, it's fine. That zombie was just dancing before he died. Oh, hello, cone zombie in the water. It's probably fine. The stars are gonna, gonna do their thing now. Uh, and I want to actually set up some of the... I think I was actually right when I said about the stars going in the directions that they go. I'm surprised, but uh, I want to price I want to set up the the spike weed, but I don't know if I'm going to get that in. Just because I'm waiting for more sun at the moment for everything. I'm going to do that because it's going to take out my plantain. So I might as well get my revenge. I know I just planted that, but I'm going to put that there instead. Give me more sun. More sun. I know I just spent it all because I was putting in the spike weed, but I need more stars right now. I should. I really need to focus, is what I'm saying. Oh, yes, do that. I think I should actually just focus on the stars. Since they're so helpful in hitting every direction. They're so helpful. Because they shoot backwards in every other direction. Let's do that. Try and triangulate everything and get the best stuff. You can kind of leave gaps sometimes to be more efficient. Kind of. This is looking better now. Okay, let's get rid of that and put this in, please. Thank you. Okay. Okay. It's not perfect yet, but it's looking pretty good. It's looking very good. I almost have a second row of stars, and then I don't think there's anything that's going to get through. But I'm going to keep working on it, so that over here after I grab all the sun that I have over here. So much sun and stars. I was so tempted to put that in just then. But I probably shouldn't just yet. Also maybe it's better to put it on the there and there with the stars because they, they go diagonal so that's going to hit more probably. Also hello you. Please take him out, please take him out, please take him out, please take him out, please take him out. No, 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 no. My sunshroom. 
Okay. Well, that's a shame. We need more stars. Like that. That should take care of all of them. Like that. Ah, no. No, 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 no. Just stop it. Stop doing that. Need to put in some more of the spike weed, I guess. But now I have to wait so long before I can actually see what's up there. It should be fine. I'm going to make sure I defend this down here, though. Oh, Jack in the Box. There's so much stuff everywhere. It's fine. It's all fine. Put another star, I guess. Possible. Thank you. Well, this is a shame. <laughs> That's all I have to say about this. Well, there we go. Close enough. <laughs> it's good enough, it's fine. It's just my hopes and dreams. We get a pumpkin. Which is uh, a protective upgrade, I guess, to any plant. So we just place it on top of a plant and it'll have an extra... It's like a walnut, but you can convert any plant into a walnut. By putting this on top of it, so. Except itself, I don't think, so. Oh, Pogo Zombie. We probably want to have toll nuts for that. Ah, ha. Also, toll nut in a pumpkin is probably good to have, so let's do whatever I can. Oh, I want to get rid of the fog. I don't think there's any balloon zombies, but I'm going to need toll nut, and I'm going to need pumpkin, and I'm going to need star fruit. What is this lineup? <laughs> what is this lineup? It's a mess, but it's fine. Let's see how this goes. Is there more fog or am I crazy? I'm not sure at this point. It's hard to tell. Okay. So I'm going to want to have the toll nuts out as soon as possible, but that's going to be a bit difficult when the sun's producing this slowly. It does seem like the fog's further across the screen. Just a very slight- just very slightly. But anyway. Okay. Also, there's only one wave of zombies in this level, so this one could just be a short level, possibly. Uh, I don't think I'm gonna put a plant in out just yet, sadly. M for multiple reasons. Probably because it's, it's gonna be destroyed if I put it out too early. But also, there's not enough sun, so I need to focus on sun. Please plant it. Thank you. Nope, that's not where I wanted that. That's fine. Ah, uh, I made a mistake. I'm tempted to restart. It's fine. It's all fine. I'll just get more sun from it until it's destroyed or something. <laughs> ah, ah, the mistakes have been made. There's a cone zombie on its way. Take it out, please. Oh boy. Let's see what we're looking at on the top half. Want that. This is a mess already. Didn't really need that there either. It's fine. It's all fine. I needed sun shrooms. There we go. Let me get rid of that now. It's a bit of a waste, but it's fine. Um. Oh, Pogo Zombie. No, no, no. He's just gonna keep pogoing until he reaches the end, you know? He's just gonna keep pogoing until he reaches the end. I can't stop him. No, I can. Cool. Nope, he got destroyed. Great, so I just wasted everything, and there's another zombie there that's broken through, and now I'm in more trouble. Hopefully that will be able to take that out, thank you. Ah, uh, Planton's gonna get destroyed, maybe. I don't know what's happening anymore. It's fine. Give me the star. I really need more toll knots out, out there. And regular attacks, apparently, as well. I just need so many more things that's not happening right now. Uh, I don't even know where to put my plants. I need more sun. 
Oh, you destroyed the plantain. This is a shame. Let's put that there. Okay. Here's the wave of zombies. Already. This is not good. This is such a mess. Oh, I've made a mess of everything. Please win. Please win. Please win, please win. Thank you for taking out him. Just a few other things to take out. I don't know how I've made it through this level. I don't know how I've survived. I made so many mistakes. I think the stars have probably saved me from everything that's happened in this level. Not the plantern. It's fine. Just undigging everything up. Because I'm mad right now. It's fine. There we go. And now we get something to go along with our plantain. It's a fine addition. The magnet shroom removes helmets and other metal objects from zombies. So if there's a pickaxe, a bucket, a helmet, or a door, they'll get magnetized to the magnet shroom, which means that we won't have as much promise to deal with. But also has to get rid of what it brings to itself, so it's not going to be active all the time, but it's going to be helpful to get things, get rid of things, so. But anyway, that is it for now, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.